Hi guys, and welcome to another video. So today's video is a little something different. I'm going to show you how I get unready. So basically get unready with me. First, we're going to take off. Maybe I can zoom in. Zoom it out. I'm zooming in. Okay. Y'all can see me? Okay. So I'm going to take off these eyelashes. These were some eyelashes I believe I got from like when I ordered some hair at one point. Y'all know I love my Amazon lashes. These are okay, but it's something about my Amazon lashes that I just have to have. So I use the Walmart Sensitive face Facial Wipes to start the process. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm almost out. I don't know why I didn't pick up any more when I was in there this morning. So I basically just wipe the makeup off first. I know some people use like cleansing balms. I just got finished doing a video. So y'all get an idea of what I do. I like do videos. Uh, and then come and wash my face. Not unless I'm going to work or something. That's a lot. Uh, your cleanser alone, I don't feel like you can get the job done. Like you have to go in with something beforehand to start the process. Oh, that's what we're doing today. And I just basically just make sure I can get a head start on removing the makeup. And as you can see, it's a lot of makeup. <laughs> that's a lot of makeup. I got two left, so that can get me I could go tomorrow to Walmart and pick up some more I just was in there and it didn't cross my mind that I needed to get some more but I used the sensitive one I used to like buy the is it Neutrogena ones I think that's what they're called but like Walmart is like half the price so why not if I'm just trying to wipe off makeup and then go in with my cleanser? So, yeah. I make sure I get by this nose ring. I need to change out my nose ring. Because the makeup can get under there. Under my nose ring. And around it, yeah, like a lot of makeup can get under there. And especially my hairline. Because even when I'll go in and then I'll like start cleansing my face, I'm like, dog, all of this is still, makeup is still by my hairline. So, yeah. And I'm going to run the water to get it warm and then I'll be right back. Okay, so I only use white cloths, white towels, white everything. My sheets are white. Everything is white. I just be wanting to see everything. I want to be able to see everything. So I only use white. What prompted me to do this uh, skincare or whatever is my face has been going through some things. Probably because of what I've been eating. And a combination of I need to clean my makeup brushes. Just being honest, this is an honest channel over here. But I've had this product probably for the last four or so months. And I never tried it. I never saw any reviews. I never saw any suggestions about this product. I got it from free from I got it free from Alta. And I was just like, okay, it's just something free. Just left it in a box and never thought anything of it. So my skin was going through it, and I said, hey. If the old products I were using, because you know, sometimes your skin can get used to certain products and it's almost like, okay, now I need to switch up. So it's the Keys Soul Care Golden Cleanser. And I got this free, excuse me if I'm out of breath. I was, I ran to go get the uh, washcloth. Huh. So <laughs> that's sad, ain't it? That is real sad. But anyway. So, yeah, I got it free from Ulta. Something was going on, and I got it for free. And I'm like, okay, like I said, four or five months ago, I said, well, let me try it. And ever, I've been using it now maybe two weeks, and it has improved my skin so, so much. 
and it says you know of course it's vegan and cruelty free pump into wet hands and work into a gentle lather gently massage over face and neck rinse with warm water use morning and night and I only went and pumped some I usually do two pumps in my hand and it smells gentle like how does something smell gentle no no but anyway so it's not like a perfumey uh, cleanser and it feels so I'm like okay well let me try it and see and if I break out then I'll know it's this right I tried it day one didn't break out day two didn't break out and I just saw so much improvement in my skin in that little bit of time that I was sold I went to Ulta the other day you'll see a haul I purchased the moisturizer so i'm like okay well if the cleanser is so good then maybe the moisturizer is good too and then i could just use that to see you know how it treats my skin and how my skin uh, reacts to it but yeah it just had to go in circular motion i don't feel like my skin is stripped and it's very gentle because i know i get it in my eyes i know i do and it doesn't burn I'm just clumsy like that. But I, I do circular motions like it's there is. Circular motions, circular motions. And let's rinse. And see, I still have makeup coming off on my hands, so like makeup is still there. I'm sorry, I'm not looking the right place in the camera. I don't know where to look at. I rinse it with my hands first, and then I'll go in with the cloth. I love warm water. I love hot water. I thank the Lord every day for hot water and water. I can stay in the bathroom in the shower for hours if you let me. And see, I still got makeup on there. But yeah, the wipes, the wipes start the process. And then my cleanser and everything finishes it. So, just to make sure I'm extra cleansed, you probably don't have to, but I go in with the second cleanse, cleanse step or whatever. I do it twice. Because I want to make sure like all the makeup is off, right? All the makeup, everything is off, and I'm good. Uh, it feels good. It smells to me almost like a slight vanilla, banana scent, but it's gentle. Okay. And I don't, I just, I appreciate the fact that it, it's not harsh. Or I don't feel like it's stripping my natural oils out of my skin. Like, I still need my natural oils, you know what I mean? So, this is what I do. And I kind of like pat it. Oh, it feels so good. Thank you, Jesus. Oh. I love hot water. <laughs> okay. So, I semi let this do what it's going to do. Let it dry for a little bit. And then put a pimple patch right there. Okay. So, I picked up the other day Good Molecules Discoloration Serum from Alta. It was $12. This will be my first time trying it with you guys. I got a couple of dark spots right here. 
that I need to. Am I in the picture? Can y'all see me? Put attention to. So this just says at the cleanser, apply to areas. So we're going to see. We'll apply it. It's basically my chin area. No scent or anything, which is good. And I'm going to do that little spot on my forehead. It comes with a dropper, too. I'm going to show y'all. I'm so used to just doing it. I forgot I was talking to y'all. So catch that. And it says to let this fully dry before going in with moisturizer. So I'll be right back. Okay. Next up. Let me get up. want to come down hold on y'all okay let me see if I can yeah that's better since they want to do what they want to do okay so I picked up the key soul care skin transformation cream and this says that it's in partnership with a board certified dermatologist and it this fragrance free potent yet gentle clean formula hydrates and nourishes for plump and radiant skin and it was $31 from Ulta but I was so impressed with the cleanser I decided to give this a try and yeah it reminds me the look of it reminds me of that Bobbi Brown skin thing but you know that's kind of like a primer but this is a moisturizer so I just put it on the back of my thumb and I'm going to rub it in. Some days I don't tone or exfoliate my skin every day. My skin is real sensitive. So I can't do that every day without it irritating my skin. Well, and it doesn't feel greasy, which I like. It has kind of like a herb like smell to it though it smells like leaves or burnt burnt oil or something but we'll see this is probably my second time using the moisturizer so we'll see how that reacts but as you can see if you can see i'm looking plump my face is looking cleansed cleansed and this is how my face looks, y'all. I just want to show you guys that I don't have perfect skin, but I work on making it right, you know? So don't never think that when you get on here and look at YouTube and you see these people doing makeup or whatever videos that their skin is just perfect and they don't have any issues or anything. I love to do my videos with no filter, no added smoothness no nothing so y'all get the real deal on how makeup looks on someone with no i'm not going to call it problem problematic skin but just regular skin you know what i mean so yeah let me get the pimple patch i used to show you guys and i'll be right back okay guys so for the pimple patch i use it's called the rael beauty miracle patch invisible spot cover ideal for the surface spots so this is how it looks it protects from dirt draws out fluid and provides a protective barrier 24 patches it was $5.98 from walmart i ordered the first time i ordered one of these i ordered from amazon and i was in walmart the other day scrolling around and i was like oh they sell it here and it comes with two thingamajigs. So we're going to open one so we can put it on this area of concern. And I know it comes from me eating sweets. I like eight sweets all weekend long because I was doing good on my so-called imitation diet. And then I had a sweet urge and that was it. I was tearing the sweets up. But I'm back to normal now. It must be the one more time a month thing. So just take my little pimple thing. I look right here because I can't see. And put it. And I like these because they stick. You know what I mean? They stick and they, I don't have to worry about it falling off or anything. 
like it's there. Some people um put these on and wear makeup, but like over it, I guess like if they gotta go to work or somewhere, they'll put makeup over it. But I'm just gonna put one right there and the rest is good to go. So that is it guys. That is my un get unready with me routine using some new products, but I'll make sure to keep you all updated. But so far I'm in love with the cleanser. I'll let you all know about the moisturizer if that works for me and i love these uh patches also so if you're in walmart and you have and you want to try them they're in walmart in the cosmetic section yeah so if you enjoyed today's video please make sure you like comment and subscribe and i'll see y'all later bye guys